What would you do if you run a zombie apocalypse right yeah. at this moment? How would you survive? Wait, right now? Find the nearest female zombie. Oh. <laughs> Let's be honest. If there was a zombie apocalypse, we all know who caused it. The British people, bro. No, yeah, they're playing yeah. me. They're pretty much already zombies. I'm going to say it was Mr. Beast. He did it. Mr. Beast. It was him. What? It was him. Yeah. No. Yeah. Mr. Yeah. Beast. Uh -huh. It's the year 2024, and he's officially lost his mind. It's got to be the Carl Candy. He decides to release a virus on the world. And it's all for a YouTube video. Why would he do that? 200 million subscribers special. I would get zero views. Everyone would be dead. He, he's going to say it like this. This is an intro. He's going to say, Last to survive, this deadly virus will win the whole planet Earth. Exactly in that tone. Holy moly. Obviously, I, the alpha man, I am. You know, I've survived. And all of you guys are zombies, obviously. And my first goal is to get protection. Now, what would be the best protection against a zombie apocalypse? Obviously, my own dragon. Dragon? You want this dragon too? His dashing helmet, his footwear, his unbelievably good looks. Thank you, Dragon City, for sponsoring this video. <laughs> it's a free-to-play mobile game available on all devices where you can build an empire with floating islands, farms, habitats, buildings, and collect over thousands of dragons of unique designs. Can my dragon fly? Yeah. Incredible. <laughs> There's flame, nature, ice, electric, and many more. Basically, just think of everything. They have it. You can hatch your eggs and then feed your baby dragons and watch them evolve. You can even get my dragon through offers, the breeding island, or in the maze island. You got your own dragon? Uh-huh. You will never get bored with these weekly mini games to claim prizes, and you can even catch new dragons every day. I want my own dragon. Dragon, where, where's my dragon? Dragon, blood in place. He's right there. He wants his dragon. You can even unlock advanced game features like this wizard hollow. A wizard dragon? Shadow wizard dragon gang. So what are you waiting for? Download Dragon City today. Use the link down below or scan the QR code. You get a huge free starter pack of 15,000 food, 30,000 gold, and 10 gems. And you can play with the size of one dragon. I'm going to breed the socks for one dragon. My actual first goal is to reach the Mr. Beast Island. He has a Mr. Beast nuke silo in there. This is how happening in one year and by the time this video comes out it's probably already happening right now at this very moment so good thing that they're watching this video because now you know what to do hello zombie me we got to go to mr beast island how do we get there right i need to get myself strapped up i need a weapon my weapon of choice is a frying pan it's a, there's no better option it's a two-in-one deal okay you can smack the zombies heads and you can make an omelet isn't that very unsanitary ah it's fine it's fine okay there's a lot of zombies they're surrounding me. No problem. I stick out my arms and I go, you know, like a helicopter. Two frying pans, helicopter positioning movements. No zombie can even touch me. If you go too fast, you'll lift off, bro. The second thing I need is to feed my hunger. Okay, how am I going to reach the Mr. Beast Island if I don't have my Mr. Beast hamburgers? You know what I do? I set up a automatic chicken farm, just like in Minecraft. Damn. Joe, with the water. Look, see, Blaz already knows. We're not talking about that basic fence with chickens inside. I know what he's talking about. But it's 2023. There's no water. It doesn't exist. What do you mean there's no water, Beef God? It's a zombie apocalypse, not a global warming. <laughs> not a global warming. Warming. <laughs> this is my chicken farm, all right? Take a look at this, okay? Oh, wow. <laughs> that all looks right. so good. It is, okay? <laughs> I'm talking about a one-by-one one space. You fill it with thousands of chickens, all laying eggs into a hopper. How are they going to fit in there? Bro, I will make them fit, okay? I'm here for survival. They, okay, and here, here's the here's the next level, all right? When they shoot out their eggs, it goes into a hopper that goes into a dispenser that then shoots out the eggs underneath the lava. And guess what? When those eggs hatch, babies, and then the babies grow up and then they automatically burn in the lava because when they grow into an adult they're too big so they burn and die what are you gonna eat now though do you have to wait for them to grow up why don't you okay. just bring some eggs Genius. with the pan don't you need chickens what are the chickens gonna eat uh seeds where are you gonna get seeds from in a destroyed world okay so basically i got infinite food and i got weapons i can make my way to mr beast island it's all set and covered one thing though I still got to get to the island, right? And I got to go undercover. I was going to say they're kind of smart, but after talking with you guys, I don't know. <laughs> uh, let's just say they're smart because uh, we're going to think 10 steps ahead, all right? They're, they're, the zombies are expecting a Ford F-150, you know, with 512 gigs of RAM, a 16K so camera, 
spikes, Holy mini moly. guns, you know, the whole package, right? That's what they're expecting. So instead, I take a bicycle. A bicycle. Oh, a bicycle. Okay. Like, okay. Mm, it's like yeah, an electric right. one or just nope. just a paddle one. All right, what if the zombies bite off your legs? What are you going to do then? What if you drive over broken bottle and both of your uh, tires are flat? You're, you'll be screwed. I think the what legs if are more important than the tires. bicycle seat is uncomfortable? What about that? What if your zombie steals your bicycle? That happens all the time. I have spare bicycles, so we're good. The thing is, I'm bicycling, right? All past these zombies, because they're looking for those crazy cars, you know, with the with the weapons and stuff. So they're not going to go for me because I'm on a bicycle. They're going to be like, that guy's crazy. He can't be human. Yeah, they're listening through like the V8s and mm -hmm. stuff, and they're waiting for it, but you're just paddling by. <laughs> <laughs> I'm riding my bicycle all the way to Mr. Beast Island, and we're good. We're there. Bro, we can drive over water. Oh, my bicycle can go over water. Okay. I enter the Mr. Beast bunker, and bam, I nuke the entire world, eliminating every single zombie. Just like that. What if the nuke oh. goes plop in the water, and it kills nobody? A nuke would nope. still kill I think. No, because I'm, I'm in the bunker. I'm safe, and I marry my bicycle, and we live happily ever after. Oh, that's so cute. Bicycle children? Who has a better zombie apocalypse story? Let's find out. Be right, be right. If there was a zombie apocalypse, uh, hypothetic, I would be dead. I would be in a million pieces. But if there's a slight chance that I would have survived and I have a home, I have the perfect zombie defense. People are saying turrets, machine guns, sniper rifles, barbed wire, landmines. Get out of here! I don't want to see it. Oh I don't want to see it. I brought an image. It's a little soggy from the water. It's a little soggy. I think I'm sure you can still see it. Fat males. <laughs> I put front balls. Story. You shut the hell up. You see that little man on the right? He is walking to up to your house. Uh, 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 brains. Uh. You turn on the trap mills. You tell your wife, wife, turn on the trap mills. And the trap mills are like, flying up. And they'll be walking and walking and walking. And then walking so long, they will literally burn all their fat to the bone and they will die instantly. What about for power? Right. How are you going to power it up? That is genius. Right. That is true. And I thought about that that way. Thank you. Oh, Thank oh, you. oh okay. Well, so, we've run out of power. We've run out of food. We've run out of water. Where do we go? Are you asking me? I, I don't think me. I don't know. I don't know. I need water. I need food. I need electricity. You, but you need water? A Walmart? My idea was I go to the Walmart. And me going to Walmart, I'm just going <laughs> to use one of these plastic balls. What are they going to do? <laughs> what are they going to do? Do. Gonna roll my way to Walmart. Gonna get my AAA batteries. Roll back to home. Replace them. And I'll be alive. Wait, I got some bad news. I think treadmills only run on double A. You're gonna have to go back. <laughs> Okay, I'll be right back. Is that your zombie apocalypse strategy? That's it. Nine out of ten. Thank you. You guys want to hear about my story? I'm in a zombie apocalypse. I, I'm the only one left alive, or I think. I'm the only one alive. A zombie apocalypse. As soon as zombie apocalypse happens, a thought comes in my head. My friends must be zombies too, right? So I, you That's know, the I'm first like... time that he has a thought. <laughs> Any sort of consciousness. Oh, everyone just died. I'm just going to... Oh, wait. What's happening in the world now? I, I got up to mean God, and he's a zombie. He's like... Bleh, 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 bleh. I love balls. I love men. I think that's how he sounds right now. I see meme guy as a zombie. I'm like, oh my god, that's me, me. Okay, I go and bring him to my basement. Wait, are you sure you want to say this on YouTube, man? I think yeah, kinda... yeah, I'm not. All right, so meme guy zombies in my basement. I mm -hmm. lock him up behind a glass wall. He's like, bah, 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 give me balls. How did you manage to bring me down to the basement and lock me in a glass? I put another male zombie down there, and you got excited. Okay, it's oh not my god. my fault. Meme guy's down there, and I'm like, hmm. Good I grab a bunch of galab jamins and just eat it right in front of him. Mm, I'm so good. I love having balls in my mouth. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> yeah, like just galab jamins. Mm, <laughs> <laughs> wow. Torturing him for Stop my it. amusement. I make him dance. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this guy is out of control. <laughs> what did I do? What did I even do to you? You know how I thought I was the only one alive? Apparently, Mim God's mom is not his mom. <laughs> All right, buddy. All right, buddy. I think uh, I think you're done. I think you're done. <laughs> I can't let humanity f succumb to its illness. I ask Mim God's mom, will you save the world for me? I, I'll reach my hand, wait for her to grab it. You know, since Mim God <laughs> amused me with his begging, I might as well give him the return. I'll amuse him with one final act of forgiveness. I'll amuse him. 
him with his mom. <laughs> now, wait, I, I, I rate that. Um, yeah, I rate that. That. That's that's what. That's the rating of that story. <laughs> I think. Uh, ten out of ten. I think it, we hear a true zombie apocalypse story. We Me. we should listen to. Uh, we should listen to Ali. First, I'm going to Texas. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> they have a lot of guns. I'll never run out of guns. And then I'll find a good place that has like a lot of supplies, right? So a Walmart. A Walmart. <laughs> like a Walmart's just the go-to for everyone for supplies. Plaza, have you ever actually even been to a Walmart? <laughs> I've been to Walmart one time and I kissed a guy. All right. Are you cheating the... on me? Oh yeah, Walmart. And um, so, and I'll surround the Walmart with treadmills. What? That guy did it! That is you! This, you this are is... a little liar. I wake up, I open my windows, and half of my treadmills are gone. I need them treadmills. You took them? How'd you take the treadmills? They're like 400 pounds. Ford F-150, bro. Oh, the He's Ford F-150. I have all these treadmills, so if the zombies, they try to get in, they'll just get stuck in an endless loop of walking. And every day, I'll just eat some food and try on like new clothes and like play video games in the <laughs> electronics section until like I just like run out of supplies or until the zombies get so jacked from working out 24 seven and break into my Walmart fortress and then I'll just die. So your story is just surviving long enough to die? <laughs> what if you don't have the key to like, you know, like they have like things locked behind the, the cages in Walmart and you need the key for it? They don't, okay, they don't lock food behind that. They're like, they're like trying to so well, now they do. About? Ever since Socks did that thing in Walmart. So, Ali, the Walmart Fortress, that is your idea. Yeah, but um, if I can't get to Texas, then I guess I'll just live on a boat and learn how to catch fish. Woman right. fishing? Woman don't know how to fish. fish. When did this guy get here? TBH, do you, do you have a zombie apocalypse survival story? Listen, okay, this is what I'm going to do. I did not steal this from any location whatsoever, but this is what would happen, okay? I will wake up from a hospital, all of a sudden, coma. Walking dead? I, you, uh, <laughs> Um, what are you saying? <laughs> and then I escaped this hospital and I'm so curious. Oh my God, what is wrong? Everything is, you had to just say the walking dead. You just had to say the walking dead. You just had to do it. You just couldn't let me tell my story. Were you just going to tell the whole first episode of the walking dead and just be like, that's how I survived the zombie apocalypse? Were yeah. the explosions, TBH? I don't see I any. was getting to it, but somebody had to tell my story for me. So that's how I survived the apocalypse all right juicy can you be what? any of these stories so i wake up i look at my tv and then I'm like, oh my golly gosh, I'm going to get ready and prepare for my defenses. Oh my golly gosh, are you going to get ready? Are you going to equip your shields, Juicy? I'm just imagining him like tying his shoes, like putting on his bow tie. Did you guys know it took me until I was like 18 to tie my shoes? That's crazy. How are you going to survive a zombie apocalypse if you can't even tie your shoes at 18? I start off in my house and you know what I do? I'm going to put loads of trampolines. Hey, hey, that's my idea. <laughs> and I'm gonna bounce up and down. How are they gonna get me? How are they gonna get me? That's so stupid. On the inside of the house? So oh, yeah, inside of the house. How are you gonna eat food, bro? There's, there's so many problems with this plan. No, I know what you mean. It's genius. How is this genius? I, there's so many problems. They're just gonna break into your house and kill you. I'll put the trampolines outside the house then. <laughs> Why oh, would they go on the trampolines? I'll surround my house with trampolines. So how what are they supposed to get in? They walk around the trampoline. Fine, fine. So they make it in the house, and then I'll fill my house with a foam pit. Me. No, those are hard to no, get up. I'm not going to lie. No, those no. are hard I to get up. Press you just live this long without zombie apocalypse or anything. I'm just I'm, surprised I'm you're living. Like, what do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> Don't you live basically in a zombie apocalypse every day in England anyway? You have to bring like swords out or something, right? I'm going to fill my house with foam, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to set up Lego traps at the bottom of my Bro, stairs. They're Lego literally, traps. they're all, dude, I don't know if you realize this, but zombies uh, are already dead. What if the zombies just eat the phone? Wait, that you gotta, you gotta eat your like home alone. They could just chew it. You're actually giving them energy. Ali's right, dude. Just all your traps are like straight from Home Alone. Like you're gonna have like a bunch of like paint that you're gonna drop on the zombies or like throw some like train toy cars at them. Yeah, and did the two guys raid the children's house? The child's house? <laughs> what? <laughs> what are you talking about? What are you talking about? Oh, you're right. They failed. Yeah, they failed. They failed. Three yeah, times. Yeah, 
How many movies are there? Like seven? There is, there is my <laughs> that, story. That is not bad, Juicy. Honestly, at least that's better than Ali's, because at least you survived. Yeah, at least you didn't steal anyone's property. Okay, Mr. Muffin, do you have a better zombie apocalypse story? I have the best one of everyone, all right? Hey, yo. Wait, before you, before, you, before you even state your story, you're, you're good, because you, like, live in the middle of nowhere that they don't even know where you are. They, like, they won't care. Probably just uh, stay with my mom. Uh, Listen, guys, <laughs> she cans a bunch of meat, okay? Uh -huh. She cans green beans, beets, mm -hmm. and meat. So I just live off that for, like, uh, ever. I'm gonna showcase you guys her canned meat. Why is it in a glass jar? Oh! Bro, it's moving! <laughs> you put it down in my moving! So yeah, I live off that for a year. I'm... Bro, you gotta start the infection. Dude, dude my mom, just she keeps making them. If I run out, you know what I do? I capture zombies and be like, make some canned zombies. And you know what? My mom will do it. You say make some canned zombies? <laughs> dude, I'm a genius. You know, you know what I do if they do come near me? I get my canned meat and throw it at their face. That's crazy. They die. <laughs> Like one ammo, you just, yeah. you just throw one of them and that's it. The bottle will snap and the monster inside the bottle will eat the zombie. That was pretty good, Muffin. At least better than some other ideas. Let's finish off strong with Mr. Meme God. Yeah. All right, and thank you guys so much for watching. Hey, uh, yeah. <laughs> if I was in a zombie apocalypse, okay, I have a foolproof plan that would not only get me to survive, but also try. I have played many Call of Duty zombies games, okay? I got the ray gun, the thunder gun, all that <laughs> stupid stuff, uh, right? Now you're talking. No but it's all useless because you just have to go around keep you know keep going around shooting guns it's so boring i just need what three things for my zombie apocalypse i need a glob jamin one glob jamin how would this help you survive a zombie Shut apocalypse up. i need glob jamin i need diljit adoshan g what and what? i need what? a trampoline a trampoline 500 foot tall and now you're copying uh, now you're taking yeah. juice's idea huh? listen, listen. Uh, step one i'm gonna eat the glob jamin okay place it into my mouth hey yo okay Spin no, it out. get my energy up okay mm -hmm. step two i spawn in diljit what still don't what? know who that is <laughs> diljit dosh is diljit doshan saying his name faster does not make me know who that is <laughs> diljit doshan ji uh wait actually it's, it's the wrong guy it's daler mendi the guy who did the even know his own story bro i will spawn in daler mendi okay and he will cheer for me okay can we skip this guy what do you mean skip me i'm the last one step three i climb up my 500 foot trampoline cut off the ladder whoa okay. where do you even get a 500 foot trampoline uh, you can't just what i built it i knew this was gonna happen i need food i kidnap the birds flying by and i force them to lay eggs so i can eat them i make a sky block eventually in the air surrounded by my trampoline bros playing minecraft what? <laughs> what? Genius. how are they supposed yeah. to get you maybe because it doesn't exist so that's your genius plan i feel like mine is way better what do you mean i actually survive in mine unlike nadway who freaking tortures me what did blaza do blaza just drowned tbh didn't even have one. What do you mean? I had a banger story. They made 18 seasons of my story. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget to download Dragon City using the link down below for all these rewards. You want my dragon, right? 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 <laughs>